The watch bezel is a circular frame that encircles the crystal. While it can add a decorative touch to the watch, it also serves a practical purpose by enabling a range of calculations. As the bezel also holds the mid-case and crystals securely in position, it is an integral component of the watch case. As such, a bezel can be considered an essential feature of any watch. In the present day, bezels are not just limited to dive watches, as they can be found on a variety of timepieces, including racing and dress watches. The bezel's role has expanded beyond its decorative function and it now serves multiple practical purposes. The Count Up and Count Down Bezel The fundamental role of a watch bezel is most evident in dive watches, where it serves as a crucial tool for divers to measure the duration of their underwater activity and calculate their remaining oxygen level to ensure a safe ascent. The Count Up Bezel measures elapsed time from 0 to 60 minutes with a 60-minute scale. The 12 o'clock position on this bezel typically features an arrow that illuminates to indicate when 60 minutes have elapsed, enabling divers to easily monitor their remaining dive time. The countdown bezel is similar to the count-up bezel but measures time in reverse, starting from 60 and counting down to zero. This functionality allows divers to track their remaining time underwater in a similar way to a stopwatch. Choosing between a count-up or count-down bezel is largely a matter of personal preference. In addition to divers, many athletes also utilize count-down bezels to time their workouts. Using a timing bezel is easy. Simply rotate the bezel until the arrow aligns with the minute hand of the current time. Once aligned, the markings along the bezel's edge can be utilized to track remaining time. The tachometer bezel. The tachometer is a type of watch bezel commonly used to measure speed by utilizing elapsed time over a known distance. Despite its complexity, using this feature is straightforward as it calculates speed based on time. The key is to understand how to read the bezel to determine speed and know the distance between two points to calculate the speed required to travel that distance. To use a tachometer watch bezel, you must first determine the elapsed time for a specific distance. For example, to calculate the speed between point A and point B, you would start the chronograph as you left or passed point A and then stop it upon reaching point B. After obtaining the elapsed time, you must determine the distance traveled during that time to calculate speed. For instance, if you traveled one mile between point A and point B in 45 seconds, you would need to locate the point on the tachometer that aligns with the 45 second mark to determine the speed. In this example, the speed would be 80 miles per hour. The GMT bezel. Also known as a world time or dual time bezel, the GMT, Greenwich Mean Time bezel is an essential feature in any GMT watch. This bezel allows the wearer to display the time from more than one time zone simultaneously. The watch is usually equipped with a 24-hour marker to make reading the time across multiple zones much simpler. Using a GMT bezel is simple. Firstly, calculate the time difference between your location and the location you wish to track. Then, rotate the bezel so that the zero lines up with where the new 12 o'clock would be on your watch. The slide rule bezel. The slide rule bezel is an uncommon, but valuable feature of some watches, particularly for those in certain professions. This type of bezel serves as a versatile and intricate calculating tool, allowing users to measure airspeed, perform basic multiplication and division, calculate fuel consumption, and convert between miles and kilometers, all without the need for a separate device. Although its appearance may seem complex and confusing at first glance, the slide rule bezel is a powerful tool for a range of calculations. It operates using an outer and inner ring, as well as a scale to indicate measurements. While it may take some time to get used to, the slide rule bezel can be an indispensable asset for those who require advanced calculations on a regular basis. 
The compass bezel. The name of this watch bezel type, compass bezel, already suggests its function, a bezel with a built-in compass. While every watch can potentially function as a compass, having a compass bezel simplifies the process. This type of bezel is easy to identify by the letters on the watch case representing the different directions. It is particularly useful for travelers and hikers who need to keep track of their direction. To use a compass watch bezel, you need to first orient yourself. If you are in the northern hemisphere, you should rotate the bezel so that the south indicator is directly between 12 o'clock and the hour hand. Then, position the watch horizontally and point the hour hand towards the sun to get a direction reading. In contrast, people in the southern hemisphere should center the north marking between the hour hand and the 12 o'clock marking to set up the compass bezel. The pulsometer. The final type of watch bezel in this video is the pulsometer, which is rare and difficult to come by. It is primarily used by medical professionals to measure a patient's heartbeat over a specific period of time. While this bezel was once a useful tool, it is now considered somewhat archaic, as the medical industry has found more effective ways to measure heart rate.